Hi friends, well, we're back at it. <clears throat> I picked up a couple of things, but for the most part, right where we left off. I'm coming over here to make some iron uh, brawler's gauntlets. That's going to help me in a mission I have in just a second. Take those. All right. I can make some other stuff, so I'm going to do that while I'm at it. Let's look at leather. <clears throat> Typically... I try to uh, make simple things, so make these things. And that got my blacksmithing up a little bit. If I have anything left over, I can always uh, sharpen up stuff, so we'll go do that. At the grindstone. <clears throat> and I can make my armor a little bit better. That also helps my blacksmithing, by the way. And that's what I got. All right, good enough. So let's put those new bracers on. Got some stuff to sell and some stuff to, some other stuff to get rid of. All right, so let me tell you guys stuff, uh, something about stashing. You can't carry everything around. So I like this barrel right here. It's right outside of War Maidens. This is uh, uh, the armory. And you can open this barrel up and whatever you stick in there will literally be there forever. Right? So if I wanted to stick something in there, you open it up, drop stuff in there. And it keeps from having to uh, stash stuff in a chest in your house. You can buy a house later. Just so you know. So what time is it? Let's see here. Uh, is it this button? Nope, oh, this button. There we go. It's eight at night. So from about eight a.m. or maybe eight or nine a.m. to about uh, I don't know. Sometimes six or eight, depending on where you're at. Shops close. So you can either rest, which is using this bar, or you can just run around and run some errands and so forth. Can I spare a coin? Yeah, I could. All right, so I know you guys don't want to watch me just pick up freaking flowers all day long, but I can't stand it. They're here, I'm gonna use them later. Um, and I do a lot of stuff. Okay. Pick up these last two. Let's run up here and talk to the Jarl. He's awake 24 seven for the most part. When I say awake, He's available. Dragon's Reach, White Run. <clears throat> All right, here comes Irileth. If I don't want to talk to her, I just go around her. <laughs> Yes. Yes. A dragon attacked. Alright. He's not ready to talk to me again. So, I'm going to zoom over here and. Uh, I want to show you guys some stuff about enchanting, so I'm going to snag a couple of these stones. Generally speaking, not a good idea to be stealing. Remember, anything that's red is, you can't take. You're not friends with the person that owns it, and so forth. Alright. He's asking, let's see, how do you enchant? That's what I want to know. Let me get this quest real quick. I'll deliver frost salts, yes. This is another quest. Right. See what he has for sale. So he's probably got a couple of other uh, items. 
Let's see, I don't really need any magic robes. So if you're a wizard, you buy stuff from him. I don't like scrolls. Books. I like books. Let's get this bound sword. I'm going to use that a lot. Um, you got to start somewhere. Conjure Familiar is not a great conjuration spell. I don't want to get it. Uh, there's some healing and some firebolt and all this other stuff. I'm not going to spec for wizardry, uh, so I'm going to skip over a lot of these. And I found a um, I found a bow that enables me to do soul trap. <clears throat> so I'm going to go ahead and buy this anyways because you want to have the spells back up. It's pretty good. And I like the... Oh, he didn't have any petties. I like the petty ones. They're cheap. Rats. If you buy these, they're just more expensive. And uh, you're not fighting higher level creatures. So each, like, Grand Souls are for the biggest creatures. Greater are for, you know, medium-sized creatures. Lessers are for the small creatures. And then petty are for, like, rats and stuff. And small, weak things. All right. See if there's anything else I need. Okay, let's uh, do some stuff. First of all, we'll go into items. Let's go into books. And you got to read, you know, if you got some of these bounties, you can read them. They give you, you know, some different quests and so forth. Right? All right, now, this is where all of these are conjuration, right? And look in the upper left hand corner of the. Um, words there says spell tome, bound sword, right above that conjuration. And this is conjuration, 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 all of those. So it's con the conjuration um, school of wizardry enables you to uh, do a lot of important things that you're going to need. So read all those books, they disappear, and then ultimately you now have these in your spells. So go to magic and if you go to destruction, you're going to see the flames and sparks and stuff. Like uh, conjuration, I'm going to ready that. I want to use that a lot. Uh, I'm going to. I'm just going to go ahead and favor all these. All right, restoration. I have the healing one. I'm going to get a shout here soon. Ancestor's Wrath is my special ability, and of course, that's all that matters for now. Now we go over here, and this is how you start figuring out enchanting, so you're going to need this. Disenchant. You have to decide what you're going to keep, and what it disappears when you disenchant it. <coughs> so I want to learn this spell, or this uh, enchantment, so I have to disenchant. In other words, I destroy it, kind of like doing an experiment on it to figure out how it works. All right. I'm not going to disenchant this bow of souls because I want it. Um, I'm not going to use this really cool axe because I now have the bound sword. This is a, uh, <coughs> a summon sword. So I'm going to <coughs> disenchant that. I don't need that and I don't need this. So I'm disenchanting that. And notice my enchantment goes up. Okay. Now I got to decide what I'm going to do, right? I've got all these. Frost spells, shock spells, these are weapon only spells. Fortify magic can be for like armor and rings and stuff. So if I want, I can, uh, let's take this ring. Nope, this, this works. And I'm gonna fortify it with magic. Ooh, I get a big three points of magic. That's nothing, it, basically it just means I'm gonna get to sell it. All right. Now my enchanting goes up. Let's do it again on the ring. Let's do it again on the necklace. I have one more soul stone. Let's see if I can put something. All right. Uh, oh, let's do. It. Let's do this. Cold ring. All right. And I go up. Now again, if I was walking around with a trainer, like Feindel, he's maxed out. I can't use him anymore. 
uh, I would go ahead and be thinking about training. All right. I think I have a few more things here. I picked up some stuff. Uh, quit off of me. Yep. All right. Let's uh, remember we can go into our. Um, Here we go. We can go into our ingredients and see what we haven't tasted yet. So that, I haven't eaten the butterfly wing. I found that. Okay. Interesting. Uh, let's, I have to turn that in. Don't, don't get, don't eat that. <laughs> uh, that one. That one. That one. That one. All right. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what we can make. Ooh, resist fire. Let's do that. Resist frost. Look how many times I can make it. I, really, I can sell all of those potions and it's making my skill better. Pretty cool. This is why I pick up all that stuff. You guys are like, oh, how boring. It, it really gets your skill up. It's super worthwhile. All right. Let's see. I shouldn't have done this. I should have done this. Okay. Then I go all the way back to ingredients. There's 29 of these. Okay. Not that. Ooh. So that is how I level my guy up. I do all of the abilities every chance I get. And then I sell all those potions. You guys are like, dude man, you're freaking making crack or <laughs> brewing meth or something. Not exactly. I'm gonna go back and talk to this guy. Yes, I did. Ooh, he gave me armor. Why would he give me light armor? Oh, I didn't put any. I didn't put any points into armor. Interesting. Rumors of dragons. Pretty cool. All right, so I got to turn in that dragon stone to Firengar ultimately. Sometimes I can do it without. So I can skip through all this, right? Alright. Skip, 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 skip. Too much talking. I already got the dragon stone. Alright. So again, I didn't want anything that he had, right? I've already got all the books I need. Um, but now these are enchanted, so I can sell them. Let me give that to him. Give that to him. I could wear them, but they're in of no consequence. Uh, it won't help me really at all. So I'm just gonna get rid of that stuff. Alright. A dragon. How exciting. Alright. Let's take a quick look at my stuff again. The king gave me some armor, right? The Jarl. It does 32 armor. It's pretty good, but it's elven, which means that it's good for stealth. It's light armor. Um, and I'm a stealthy kind of guy. I am a heavy armor kind of a person. So let's take a look at this. It's better than what I'm wearing. Better than that. 
and lighter. So let's go ahead and put it on. We are out of time. Um, the bottom line is, is that I really want to be a heavy armor guy. And if I get hit, then it's going to give me credit for light armor because I'm wearing light armor. Unless I get hit in the boots or get hit in the gloves or something. Kind of keep that in mind. But right now I've got a hodgepodge of armor and I look ridiculous. Just so you know. I've got dwarven boots, elven, you know, body armor, and then human gauntlets and a helmet. Ridiculous. All right. Notice I could level up. I'm not going to level up quite yet. Let's go pick up this real quick. It was Faust. You can pick up these books and sell them if you want to. I never ran so fast in my life. Dude, I gotta go fight a dragon? Man. I do have experience with dragons, yes. So the irony is... Ooh. That sounds good. He's gonna give me more stuff? A helmet? More light armor. Alright. So what do I know about dragons? I found a dragon stone. That is what I know. So this guy really is desperate if he wants me to help him with a dragon. But I'm going to do it because I'm just a good guy. Okay. Uh, I don't need this. This is not a good helmet for me. I'm going to disenchant it. And my enchanting goes up, which is pretty good. All right, now we have to ask ourselves, self, what should we be working on? Well, we need to find a new trainer. All righty. I happen to know there's a guy walking around who might be able to train me in sword. By the way, when the guards say, wait, I know you, don't talk to them because they're going to make you pay your bounty <laughs> for stealing stuff. All right. Shrines give you a little bonus. Kind of keep that in mind. I'm still picking up stuff. I'm always picking up stuff. Okay. Let's go talk to dude here. He's usually around here somewhere. Oh, I can't stand it. I can pick up all this stuff. Anyways, uh... I am out of time. I'm way over time. So let's go ahead and wrap this session up. And we will get back to all this other dragon business and picking up uh, more alchemy items. This place is just covered with plants that I can use in alchemy. Isn't that funny? <clears throat> Alright guys. I'm going to save because I didn't do that last time. I lost all my progress when I <laughs> powered down the video camera. I'm going to go to the screen and I'll catch you guys in a minute.